Welcome. Today we're taking a deep dive into the world of micronations. These small, self-proclaimed entities may not be recognized by any official sovereign state, but they're certainly worth exploring. From experimental political projects to artistic expressions, micronations are a fascinating phenomenon that have captivated people for decades. But what are micronations exactly? And what motivates people to create them? Let's dive in and explore the world of micronations and discover the unique stories, cultures, and people behind them. We will start with the oldest micronations and work our way to the newest as there are currently 60 active micronations. Kingdom of Redonda, a small uninhabited island in the Caribbean Sea, now legally part of Antigua and Barbuda. In 1865, a citizen of Montserrat was supposedly permitted by Queen Victoria to claim the title of King of Redonda as long as he did not incite any revolt against colonial authority. Kingdom of Araucania and Patagonia after the fall of the kingdom and death of Orly Antoine, the title of King of Patagonia passed between various French citizens. The current king is Frederick Luz. Parva Domus, a self-declared centenary micronation surrounded by Uruguay that has functioned since 1878 as a social and recreational association that mimics the functioning of a real country. Since its foundation, it has had over 800,000 different naturalized citizens. Kingdom of Elor, a tongue-in-cheek micronation founded by a group of school teachers as a summer camp on the island of Elor, Denmark. Republic of Saugiais, an officially sanctioned tongue-in-cheek micronation located in eastern France in the Department of Du. Free Borough of Lawrouest, the Free Borough of Lawrouest was a special privilege granted to the Welsh town of Lawrouest by the Prince of Wales. Lawrouest is now a small town and community on the River Conwy in Conwy County Borough, Wales. The town consequently has its own coat of arms and flag, and this is the origin of the old local motto Simru, Logar Lawrouest. Nation of Celestial Space a micronation that comprises the entirety of the universe besides Earth. It was founded on January 1st, 1949 by James T. Mangan to stop other countries from claiming outer space land. Principality of Saborga, a town in the Italian region of Liguria that claims never to have been a part of the modern Italian state. Republic of Jantland, the region of Jantland was self-governing from the 10th to 12th century. The micronation movement was founded in 1963 in order to preserve and promote the Jantlandic culture, language, and way of life. It has had three presidents, hosts festivals, and boasts its own national anthem. Republic of Rathnelly, a Toronto neighborhood declared itself an independent republic during the celebration of Canada's centennial on July 1st, 1967. The Republic of Rathnelly elected a queen and celebrates Rathnelly Day biennially. Principality of Sealand, a World War II military facility consisting of a man-made structure located off the English coast that was occupied and declared to be an independent state by Patty Roy Bates. Freetown Christiania, Christiania, also known as Freetown Christiania, is a self-proclaimed autonomous neighborhood in the Danish capital of Copenhagen. The commune occupies the site of an old barracks and is home to almost 1,000 residents. Exivland, a micronation founded as a protest to the Israeli government for demolishing an illegally inhabited house. Founded by an Iranian-born Israeli named Eli Avivi and his wife, it was leased to him by the Israeli government for 99 years. Its name is derived from the nearby ancient city ruin of Exiv. He died of pneumonia in 2018. Newtopia, introduced as a conceptual nation by John Lennon and Yoko Ono on April Fool's Day, Newtopia has no land, no borders, and no passports or visas. Anyone declaring their awareness of Newtopia's existence was allowed to join. It was founded partly as a way to satirize Lennon's immigration troubles at the time. Talasa Dada Micronation founded as a bedroom kingdom by Milwaukee, Wisconsin resident Robert Ben Madison. Madison claims to have coined the term micronation. Grand Duchy of Avram, a non-territorial micronation founded by an eccentric self-proclaimed Duke, John Rudge, who was later elected to the Tasmanian State Parliament. Empire of Atlantium, based in Australia, it advocates for global governance, specifically, no borders and freedom of movement. Conch Republic, founded by then-mayor of Key West, Florida, Dennis Wardlow, it claims tongue-in-cheek independence from the United States in protest at a checkpoint established by the U.S. Border Patrol. Kingdom of North Dumpling, an island in Fisher's Island, South Old, New York, declared independent after its owner Dean Cayman was denied permission to build a wind turbine on the island. Dominion of Melchizedek, 
The Dominion of Melchizedek is a micronation known largely for facilitating large-scale banking fraud in many parts of the world. Arakan Empire, an eccentric tongue-in-cheek micronation, it claims various terrestrial and interplanetary territories. Republic of Wangamomana, declared in protest of the township of Wangamomana switching regions after New Zealand's regional council boundaries were redrawn in 1989. Washita Nation, African-American group associated with the Moorish Science Temple of America who claimed to be a sovereign state of Native Americans within the boundaries of the United States of America. Nui Sloanish Kunst, since 1991, the NSK has claimed to be a sovereign state of sorts, a claim similar to that of Micronations. 2017 saw NSK set up a pavilion at the Venice Biennale where Slavo Zizek stated that the uniqueness of NSK is this idea of the stateless state. Elgaland Vargaland, a conceptual art project by two Swedish artists, Carl Michael von Hauswolf and Leif Elgren, which defines itself as the borders of all nations. Kingdom of Enenkio claims Wake Atoll, a U.S. territory north of the Marshall Islands, and has been widely deemed a scam. Ladonia, a micronation founded by a group led by Swedish artist Lars Vilks as the home to sculptures created by him in the Kullaberg Nature Reserve in northwest Skane. Le Royaume de Lance Saint Jean. It achieved a certain notoriety when its citizens held a referendum on January 21, 1997, to turn the village into Le Royaume de Lance Saint Jean, the continent's first municipal monarchy. Kingdom of Wallachia, a tongue in cheek micronation founded in 1997 as an elaborate practical joke, located in the northeast corner of the Czech Republic. Holy Empire of Reunion. A micronation founded by Brazilian law students as a political simulation, Reunion has a very active political system. It has issued passports, minted coins, and is considered one of the most important Lusophone micronations. The micronation has been portrayed by the media of dozens of countries and has been the star of a front-page article of Reunion Island newspaper, which used it to trace a parallel between its independence and the idea of having independence from France. Republic of Uzupis. Uzupis is a neighborhood largely located in the old town of Vilnius, Lithuania. In 1997, the residents of the area declared a Republic of Uzupis with its own flag, currency, president, and constitution. Maritime Republic of Eastport. The Maritime Republic of Eastport, commonly known as simply Eastport, is a seaside neighborhood community and tongue-in-cheek micronation located in Annapolis, Maryland, in the U.S. Nova Roma, an international organ of Roman revivalists who claim to be a modern Roman nation and have the administrative structure of the ancient Roman Republic. Nova Roma explicitly states that they are not a micronation but a civitas or residential publica. Their organ, however, fits all the requirements for being classified as such. New Utopia, a proposed micronation based on libertarian principles to be built on platforms in the Caribbean Sea. It was founded by American entrepreneur Lazarus Long. The project's status as of 2006 is in question. Republic of Malaysia, a micronation founded by Kevin Baugh, occupying his semi-rural residential acreage in Nevada. It is run humorously as a dictatorial banana republic. Global Country of World Peace, GCWP is a non-profit organization that claims to promote transcendental meditation, education, and the construction of buildings for peace in the world's major cities. The organization made several attempts to create its own state in different parts of the world. Republic of Vivkani During the war in Yugoslavia, an independent committee was established in the village of Vivkani, which was threatened by ethnic conflict in what was then communist Macedonia. After the situation had calmed down, the committee joined independent Macedonia and in 2000 the inhabitants again declared independence as a micronation to promote tourism. Grand Duchy of Westarctica Duchy of Westarctica is an Antarctic micronation established in 2001 that claims the territory known as Marie Bird Land. Hajduka Republica Majadatamica, a protest project started by a local because of inefficiency of problems with the local electricity supply. Principality of Snake Hill, a family of Australian residents could no longer afford to pay taxes, and after litigation over a mortgage and being inspired by the Principality of Hutt River, they did legal research and came to the conclusion that forming a country would be completely legal under Australian law, and thus they declared independence on September 2, 2003. Kingdom of Lovely, a nation created by comedian Danny Wallace as part of his BBC series, How to Start Your Own Country. 
Principality of W.Y. established by Paul Delprat during a dispute with the local council of Mossman Municipality in Sydney over the construction of a driveway to his property. Dominion of British West Florida, a micronation intending to revive the former British colony of the same name. Zakistan, a small tract of land in Box Elder County, a remote part of Utah, on which its owner, Zach Landsberg, has built monuments. It has also issued passports. Naminara Republic. Nami Island is home to the Naminara Republic, a self-declared micronation described as a tourist destination that advocates the concept of a nation. On July 20, 2018, a retired M48 patent tank was received from the Republic of Korea Armed Forces. Austinasia, a self-declared sovereign state based in the United Kingdom. Grand Duchy of Flandrensis, an Antarctic micronation that seeks to draw attention to environmental concerns, founded by Niels Vermeers. Sovereign State of Forvik, an islet in Shetland, Scotland, declared a crown dependency by Stuart Hill as part of a Shetland secessionist agenda. Wordland, Wordland is an experiment into the legitimacy and self-sustainability of a country without its own soil, which transcends national borders without breaching or lessening the sovereignty of any involved dogs. Principality of Aigues a micronation that claims the French city of Aigues Together with local merchants and the touristic office of Aigues they created the BPAM to handle currency exchange with the local currency, the Flamand. Principality of Filetino, created by the mayor of Filetino in protest at the Italian government's austerity measure that reorganized the local government of towns with less than 1,000 residents. Romanov Empire. The imperial throne was founded by Russian businessman Anton Bakov as the Russian Empire. By its constitution, it is a federal constitutional monarchy and the successor of the empire founded by Peter I. Murawari Republic. A micronation that is the traditional homeland of an aboriginal nation. It declared its independence from Australia. Sovereign Udinji Government, a micronation that is the traditional homeland of an aboriginal nation. It declared its independence from Australia. Glacier Republic, founded by Greenpeace activists in a disputed border region of the Andes between Chile and Argentina for the purpose of drawing attention to Chile's lack of environmental protection for glaciers. Free Republic of Liberland, claims an uninhabited parcel of disputed land on the western bank of the Danube known as Sega between Croatia and Serbia. It was created by Czech politician and activist Vid Jedlica. Principality of Laos, micronation promoting tourism. Esgardia, a micronation founded by Igor Asher Bailey that aims to launch satellites into space in order to found a real nation recognized by the UN. The ultimate aim is to avoid the restrictions of the current space law framework. Principality of Islandia, the Principality of Islandia is an incipient micronation that claims the small Belizean island of Coffee Cay as its territory. It is a crowdfunded effort. Lamb Island. Lamb is a small uninhabited island measuring approximately 100 by 50 meters in the Firth of Forth, off the east coast of Scotland. It was purchased by Yuri Geller in 2009. In 2022, Geller declared the island a micronation. Geller offers citizenship, with proceeds going to save a child's heart, an Israeli charity. That's all for today's exploration of the world of micronations. From Redonda to Natopia, these self-proclaimed entities are a fascinating blend of art, culture, and political expression. Although not officially recognized by any sovereign state, these micronations offer a unique perspective on the human desire for self-determination and individuality. I hope you enjoyed learning about these unique places and the stories behind them. Please leave a comment, hit that like and subscribe button, and see you next time. Farewell.